Hi there, this is Niv from the Drone Center. From leak detection to asset inspection, remote surveillance or emergency response, the application of drones in the oil and gas sector is tremendous. And among them, the key application of drones is the flare stack inspections, specifically inspecting the flare stack while it's still active. If you're from the oil and gas industry, you might want to stay tuned as we uncover how we eliminate unnecessary flare shutdowns and prevent weeks of downtime. A flare stack is used in oil and gas sites to burn byproducts such as dangerous gases. For instance, say methane gas. Methane is up to 25 times more damaging to the environment than carbon dioxide. Research reveals that oil and gas operations account for over three quarters of the total methane emissions contributing towards global warming. And if not burned properly, methane will be released into the atmosphere as it is, and that is a big problem. Thankfully, flare stacks keep these dangerous gases at bay by directing the gaseous mixture to stacks and burning them to create safer water vapor and other byproducts. The oil and gas sector needs to ensure that flare stacks are optimized for complete combustion efficiency. Apart from saving people and the planet, it also helps the oil and gas sector adhere to environmental guidelines set by regulatory bodies. To ensure that these dangerous gases aren't released into the atmosphere, companies follow a strict inspection schedule. But how are companies inspecting their flare stacks right now? Now, when you think of the traditional flare stack inspection, you have to consider document clearance, flare shutdown, the subsequent wait for the flare stack to cool down, and security checks prior to the inspection. All these can take days, weeks, or even months, and we haven't even gotten the inspector involved yet. After all these procedures is when the actual inspection may finally begin. The remote nature of the oil and gas fields doesn't make this any easier. Once on the field, the flare stack has to be given sufficient time to cool off and expel itself of dangerous gases, and the inspector may finally begin their work. But this too is hazardous. They often have to squeeze through confined access points, climb up to dizzying heights, and brace themselves against strong winds. The required time frame for the inspection is also unpredictable. It could take days, weeks, or even months, depending on the height and size. The traditional method is hazardous, time-consuming, and labor-intensive, which is why drones are the industry's new favorite tool. Drones inspect flare stacks while they're still operational cutting down on the need to send humans into dangerous and unpredictable situations enables us to altogether eliminate the arduous and lengthy shutdown of the flare stack. The fact that the flare stack stays active throughout the inspection results in significant cost savings. Drones can safely fly and collect high resolution data from the flare tip, radiation shield, pilot ignition systems, pipework, gantries and handrails. Narrow spaces and infrastructures pose no challenge. Drones give us a general overview of the flare stack condition, its life expectancy and more. They enable the oil and gas industries to plan, organize and execute maintenance operations more efficiently and effectively, enabling them to cut down on unplanned shutdowns. What it all boils down to is you get to cut down on a lot of unplanned downtime. Now, let's take a look at the region's only ISO certified solutions provider and how they inspected one of the tallest flare stacks in the world. This massive flare stack measures in over 160 meters in height and previously inspecting this flare stack with a boots on ground approach was a slow, dangerous and labor intensive process. But with their extensive fleet of DJI drones and experienced pilots, the FEDS team could condense a four to six week long inspection into a single day. Team FEDS deployed the workhorse of the drone industry, the DJI M300 RTK, paired with the multi-sensor thermal payload, the Zenmuse H20T. While the drones did their job, the flare stack continued to burn, causing zero downtime. The team captured RGB and thermal data and processed it to create visual inspection reports. 
Using drones, they enable the client to perform preventive maintenance during routine shutdowns and identify potential failure points and ensure that the plant operates efficiently. Drone-powered flare stack inspections are safer, faster, more cost-effective and eliminate a lot of downtime. The global market for drones in the oil and gas sector is expected to reach 16.72 billion US dollars by 2025. And meanwhile, most of the major players in the oil and gas sectors have been migrating to drone-powered solutions, including BP, one of the world's seven oil and gas super majors. Drone-powered solutions will help you in escalating the efficiency of your oil and gas operations. Well, that's it for today. If there's a topic you'd like for us to cover, please leave a comment. And if you like our videos and want to see more of them, please consider subscribing. Thank you so much for joining us. See you next time.